All right, let's see how the Eldritch Defense Force falls apart. I forgot to rename you. You. Don't do it, Chase. No, don't do it. I'm. Yeah, this colony is hanging on by a shoestring in a dream. Um. Oh, okay, we do have a Thorgin. That's right. She's just imprisoned at the moment because she was having a problem. Um. We can release Thor game now. Ah, oh, goodness gracious. Um, what do you want, Bone Grind? Right. There's so much wrong with this colony right now. My issue, Vex, is like, Lennon, why are you sleeping outside? Why are you not sleeping in your bed? Oh, because someone stole your bed while you were in prison. Well, that's not helpful. Okay, bye, Dreamy. Um, okay. We're kind of low on food. Okay, where are my shooters? Jackness, what are you carrying? You are carrying the revolver that was Lennon's at one point in time. Dragon Jim is blind, so it is probably not ideal. Jable can shoot. Okay, where is the shotgun? There. Oh, yeah, sorry. Um I think about reinstalling all the time, but like I will watch people play it and I'm like, wow, looks as terrible as when I left. And it's just, it's so bad, like. Also, Vex, if you would like to, we do have an open colonist. Bone grind has not been claimed yet. To a point, I was, like, I was definitely reaching the ends of my, um, tether with it. Oh, yeah. If you've never played RimWorld Vex, uh, they just released a new expansion for it called Anomaly, and it's horror-themed. As you can see, Velasco here has a flesh tentacle.
Yes, flesh tentacle. Um, alrighty. I really wish one of these mega sloths were a little closer for this. And it's J. Will is the other shooter. I think I have a bow. I do. Okay. One, two, and four. Where's the other one? There. Well, what's your problem? Because I... Oh, you're hungry. Well, that's... That is unfortunate, because you have a shotgun, and I need you to be participating in this, because this is about to get hairy. They missed? You all missed? <laughs> it's a mega sloth. How do you miss a mega sloth? No, stop getting out of range. Stop running. Why are you running? Thank you, Velasco. Oh shit, how bad is Jay Will hurt? None of them have shooting skills. The best they have is like three. <laughs> Velasco, could you please, um,. There's no way Xan ate the entire Megasloth. No, okay. Orange was carrying it. 
I was like, no, there's no way Xan ate an entire mega sloth. <laughs> Midnight munchies, yes. An entire mega sloth of midnight munchies, no. <laughs> I do believe you ate the head off of this, though. Um, so what you are, Vex, is the most important person in my colony at the moment outside of Alaska. Um, you are our main social pawn. You are our backup doctor. It's mostly that you're our main social pawn and you're the only capable, only person in the colony currently capable of doing any sort of construction. just gonna cancel moving these I'm just gonna build new beds because we're running low on everything bed wise hello Arek To be fair, we had a workhorse, and then both you and Velasco decided to have a mental break at the exact same time, so he died of an infection. He's currently in this grave. <gasps> a baby muffalo! What gender is the newest baby muffalo? It's another baby boy muffalo. Because my life is baby boys. Baby boy muffalo and baby boy. Yay, the weather control's done. They are adorable. It's true. All right, the good news is, is we definitely have enough, um, like, nutrition with all the hay grass coming in. Jackness out here doing her best. Oh, congrats on your kid! Hey, what are you two doing wearing my toques? I made those toques for my colonists, not for my visitors. Unless you two decide to stay, at which point it's fine. But... Um, in my defense, Velasco, I'm trying to get you that Divine Nevian apparel. I need my constructors to make the Biofarite Shaper. Velasco is the only one with our ideology now. Um, the colony's ideology has, in fact, changed. I'm not happy about it, but it happened.
Yeah, so Rick, I know this colony looks like it's doing well, but it's actually kind of hanging on by a thread. Uh, the colony will die. Oh, Velasco has a toque now. She's not happy about it because it's not what she wanted. Oh, come on. I think if we lose probably one to two more colonists, I will call it and we will start another colony and go from there. But honestly, I'm pretty proud of us for still being on our second colony in Anomaly. Like, we might be able to make this work. But, uh, give Cassie time. I'm sure she will find a way to make our lives miserable. Uh, I need to put a door in here because if I don't, they're going to block it all off and then they won't be able to get in there and actually put in the geothermal. Ooh, an aurora. Pretty. That'll boost some moods for anybody out there to see it. Look at you replay. Oh no, Vex, you, you botched the construction. You botched it. And left marble bricks on Velasco's bed. Oh, no, see, she's just sleeping on top of them. <laughs> she probably figures it can't put her in any more pain than the flesh tentacle already is. Are Jay Will and Lennon flirting? Oh, hey, look at that! Lennon actually likes someone, and it's Vex. Vex hates Lennon. Lennon does not like J. Will, but J. Will likes Lennon. Who insulted you? It was probably Lennon. It is a positive. Unfortunately, your uh, your orientations do not allow you two to romance because you are both female pawns. Zan has no opinions on anyone because Zan is a ghoul. What happened to the stress signal? 
Intercepted a distress signal from a nearby camp. Frantic voice begs for immediate assistance, defending it against a threat. They offer everything at their camp in return for help, including shards of powerful arco technology. As it tries to explain the nature of the threat, the signal goes dead. How far is this? Hello, Thorgim. <laughs> that isn't terribly far. Alright, let's find a snack pack for Xan real quick. Oh look, that one's nice and close. Because we cooked up all of the muffalo meat, or uh, mega sloth meat already. not super far we can pack I don't have any raw meat to pack for Xan would be our big problem so if they went it would be people without Xan and that's dangerous I make them not take fertilized eggs. I think I might rather have the meat from the ducks than the eggs from the ducks. Corpse obsession? What? No! No! No, don't do that! Vex, arrest her! No, do not dig up COP.
Please go put him back. <laughs> uh oh. Well, life just became. him back It might be, Jackness. Or it seems to be Zan. Um, you don't. It doesn't seem like you eat rotten meat, though. So I don't think I'm too worried about that. What? Mysterious obelisk is crashed nearby. The obelisk comes with putrid psychic energy, gradually intensifying. Intensifying as it approaches some dangerous limit. You send you can send colonists to suppress the obelisk to prevent it from activating. You can also mark it for study to try and learn its purpose and perhaps make use of it. You can always attack it to destroy it, but doing so may unleash unnatural and dangerous phenomena. Well, have fun studying that, Lennon. I she was supposed supposed to have been released. I didn't want you to either, but if you had killed her, I would have. That would have ended the colony. You have lunch from somewhere. Uh, g give me just a second, quick. To ensure that this colonist isn't going to as easily or quickly die. Although if she dies, it's the end of the colony. Just gonna go and uh, shove some unnatural healing into her. Oh no! I'm just gonna let that sit there for y'all to read, and I'm gonna talk to Lennon real quick.
So I'm a little concerned about our main doctor having a tentacle arm. She does already have one. Oh, Vex is on a psychite binge. No, it's just her one arm, right? N oh. Oh, it is both. Oh no. make so much psychic tea at a time because we have somebody who's actually a di like because Jackness needs it <laughs> With the obelisk, it pulsed with energy and generated a flash of light. Lennon found herself face to face with a copy of herself. The duplicate came claims to be the real and has joined the colony. This colony is going to die in a horrific fashion, isn't it? ideology anymore. The ideology of the the colony changed last session. The number of archists in your colony has reached three. You can now assign the role of priest of archism to one of your colonists. To assign a role uses yeah, yeah, I We are currently archism, but <laughs> Oh no. What do I do with the other Lenin? <laughs> Well, Velasco does regular research. Well, that's, that's what we have Velasco for. Velasco is actually our, our other researcher. Oh, yeah, I don't have enough beds for anybody. <laughs> Shit, I can't even tell the difference between them. Because they're wearing the same outfits. 
Do they have the same feelings towards each other? They don't. Jackness, look, this one likes you. Like, really likes you. Maybe? Maybe we should be worried about that. Where is original Lennon? Okay, he's sleeping. This Lennon is... Well, that doesn't make me feel very comfortable, now does it? <laughs> eh, yeah. Oh, poor Velasco, look at her arms! <laughs> look at her arms! Is that egg fertilized? It is. Good. I would like more ducks, please. Which Lenin? The new one. Who insulted? Oh. God, still pulling all of the... <sighs> oh good, Vex is done with the, the psychite break. What's our wildlife looking like? You need to get back up to the colony. This is way far away for you to be.
I assume everybody wants treatment for their muscle parasites. Oh, unwaveringly loyal. Won't even look at his stats then. should suppress that but I kind of want to see what it does and this colony is already in such a in such a state <laughs> items to trade. I don't have much in the way of silver, but you know. have anything. Oh, but they'll take the Ambrosia. That's way too much money. Um... They're having a party, so I'm just gonna let them have it because I, some mood boosts would be nice, honestly. Oh, oh, I saw that. Okay, you have <gasps> frag grenades and a shotgun. Pistol and a knife. Uh New Lenin, or Old Lenin hates New Lenin. Wait, that's the game. Oh, they hate each other. The, the Lenins hate each other. 
Uh, Velasco, I don't know if you saw. There was um, a development. This landed here. We studied it and Lenin cloned himself? Both are insisting they're the real Lenin. <laughs> Sick Apollo, yeah, um, I still haven't gotten the email I was expecting. <laughs> so we'll see. We could, or we could just not. I fuck, why did the frag grenade want to have to be so close? Um. Velasco has stun. Maybe I can... Yeah, no, it's... It's fine. It's more just... Anyway, it doesn't matter. Um... Shit, Jay Will's still fucked. Hi, COP. Um, I have some terrible news. And then, and then it gets worse. Velasco dug up your body and put you on display at one point. Attacking immediately. No, they're preparing, which is way worse. Uh, J. Will has our pump shotgun and is in the middle of a mental break. Velasco is injured and does not seem to have her ability to stun anymore. Oh, wait, no, there it is. Okay. Oh my god, it just insta-gibbed Zan. turret Shit 
shit. I think Phoebe, I think Phoebe got us. Yeah, I think, I think that's... I think that is goodbye to the Eldritch Defense Force. <laughs> the one in Problem is sold. <laughs> Uh, we knew we were in a downward spiral, which is actually why we've just been exploring this and not anything else. There's no one left who can actually fight. grenade at our pet squirrel. What happened to the other one? Oh, it's bleeding out up there. Good. Goodbye, Eldritch Defense Force. 